Demonstrations took place in several parts of Egypt on Friday with Muslim Brotherhood supporters calling for protests to mark four years since the January 25th revolt that toppled Hosni Mubarak and led to democratic elections. The Brotherhood's Mohamed Morsi was elected president but was removed by the army in 2013 after mass protests against his turbulent one-year rule. Abdel Fattah al-Sisi, the ex-army chief behind Morsi's removal, went on to win a presidential election in May. He launched a crackdown that has seen Egypt's oldest Islamist movement driven underground and thousands of its members arrested. In the latest development, an Egyptian court has ordered a retrial for 37 Muslim Brotherhood members sentenced to death and 115 others sentenced to life in a mass trial last year, according to judicial sources. Human rights activists say a law restricting protests and other security legislation enacted by Sisi have rolled back freedoms won in the 2011 uprising. As for Mubarak, on November 29th last year, an Egyptian court dropped cases against him on charges of ordering the killing of protesters during the 2011 revolt and graft. In a separate corruption case, charges were also dropped against Mubarak and his sons, Allah and Gamal, with the judge saying too much time had elapsed since the alleged crime took place for the court to rule on the matter. The 86-year-old was found guilty in May in another case related to theft of public funds and has been serving that three-year sentence while under house arrest. The court also dropped its case against former Interior Minister Habib El Adli and six other Mubarak aides on charges of ordering the killing of protesters. The release of some Mubarak-era figures last year had already raised fears among activists that the old leadership was regaining influence. Clementine Logan, CCTV.